Hey guys, it's me, uh, Jokerfan519 here, and I'm, uh, doing my second mask vlog. Not much is going on, but, um, pull got the part of the sculpture out of, uh, there's some holes in it, but I got, uh, my, uh, Art the Clown mask here. It's the mold. Something's on my phone. But, um, yeah. Just need to get all this monster clay out, um. I recommend don't use a hair dryer or anything to get the clay out, the monster clay. Because if you do that and use heat, um, plaster will turn wet apparently. And then it'll get holes in it. That's how these holes, one right there and one right here. That's a big hole, but yeah. Most, this is the mask I uh, used to uh, sculpt onto with the nose. I didn't use this nose, but I sculpted with monster clay. It's hard to explain, but I'm just trying to glue these straps on. Use super glue because I. Uh, uh, where, where'd it go? I don't know where I put it. Oh, yeah, it's on the back porch. But I used uh, E6000, but that didn't want to work, so. Just decided to use. What is this? Loctite super glue. Needed a, a new one because the cap on is broken. So I just jam it on there because uh, I can show you real quick. Here, just a second. I don't know how well you can, I don't know how well you can see it, but the nozzle's stuck in there, and it's just like, uh, I'm broken, come on, focus on a bitch, come on, not sure how well it's focusing, but, here, let me try, yeah, there we go, it kind of works. But yeah, that's pretty much, oh wait, I did get, uh, this finished, I painted it, um, remember I, uh, painted it black, like, a long time ago, with, uh, I actually got the paint in here, both paints, actually, Hansel, no, um, first I used this black paint for the base, um, so got a little bit left in there, and I also used the same brand of white, basic, basics, you know, I need more white because it's pretty much empty. I just kept going. But, yeah. So, yeah. I, I like how it looks. It looks more white on person, but it looks more weathered in person. But on video, it looks very white. Yeah. It's alright, but... Still need to add blood to this thing, but I don't know how well the blood's going to apply to... The fake blood I have is going to apply to this mask. Cut some more holes out of it, like here. Don't know if you can see it that well, but see it right there. Uh, right there. Right. God damn it. Right. <laughs> right here. Right here. Cut the neck out a little bit. Right there too. Over here. This little one. I even did a right here. Um. Uh, where else did I do it? Oh, yeah, on the lip. Okay. Hold on. See? Now I'll it on the chin. See, that's pretty cool. I did a little bit down here, but not really all the way up. I just cut out the legs a little bit. Um, so, yeah. I really like how this one turned out. It, for a child's mask, I don't know where I put the tag, but... Uh, it actually looks decent, like decently painted. Like my my adult size one from Fun World, it just looked like they just slapped a bunch of paint on it. It just looked ugly. But this is actually newer than my custom, my other custom one. But uh, this one's actually from twenty twenty one, I think, and the other one was like from twenty nineteen. I think I don't remember. <laughs> but this one actually looks better, which is weird. It's also a child's mask. It doesn't really show up in, on camera that it's that good. But in person it looks awesome. It looks very weathered. Especially back here. It's not really showing up that well, but whatever. Um, the only complaint I have with these masks is the hair. It's like cotton. So you just pull it out. But I'm trying not to do that. Um, what else? Still need to work on... This KMB, 
Um, you're watching that Mr. Studio. Sorry if I ruined your creation, but I'm just trying to make it look nice. But I don't know. Um, what else do I have? It's a strap. I think that's pretty much it for this mask vlog. It's really short. Like, Jesus, it's only five minutes. But I don't really have anything else to show. Mask wise. I know yesterday's video was pretty long. All well, the time we're recording this, it was yesterday. Like, today is. What's the date? Uh, I don't know. Uh, it's Tuesday, February 21st. So. Yeah. My movies. Some action figures. I need to go in the storage to get my uh, other action figures out. I want to just replace like these ones. Like I might keep Punisher and Daredevil. And maybe Bullseye. But I might replace Tom, or Tom Holland Spider-Man maybe. I don't know. Maybe just. I don't know what I'm going to do with these. I just want to get some Star Wars figures out. I only have three Black Series, but I like them. Got Jango Fett, Boba Fett, and Rey. I know Rey's not the best, but she was my first, so... It sounds weird, but... She was my first. She was my first Black Series, you... Bastards. Um... I don't think there's anything else. But, uh... Yeah. Um. Oh, here's one of the tags for. Yeah, this is the adult one. This one made. April, June 2020. So, yeah, that that one's. Wait, what? Yeah, that one's 2021. I don't remember. I have to find the tag. But that one. This one that I repainted to hell. Which I actually think it looks better. Um, this was, it looked like shit, that's why I repainted it. Huh. I think I know where the tag is, let me check. Yeah, it's right here under this thing, because I didn't have anywhere else to put it. Fuck. God damn it. <clears throat> Nail goes on the wall. I know, very unprofessional, but... What's the date on this one? Oh, 2022. I thought it was like 2020. I don't remember. Yeah, it's April, June 2022. Huh. This one's like two years newer. Or two years uh, younger than uh, my other one. But that one I think I got in like 2016, but I threw away the tag because I don't know why. I didn't collect tags back then. I still collect some tags like my... Uh, I already have one tagged there, my Scream 4 uh, zombie ghost face, and I have the tag for my untagged version. I also got some other tags up here, like my uh, Trigger Tree Studios Halloween 2 vacuum form plastic mask, that foam Jason mask which I gave to a friend, my uh, Halloween 2 deluxe mask, Michael Myers mask, vintage clown mask, I have another one, and that mask. <laughs> Don't think I have any other tags because I think I re-tagged my Brandon James. Um, I'm not sure if I have any others. I'm not sure. I might somewhere, but I'm not sure. Hmm. Here's my Funko Pops. I just realized I'm zoomed in to sell. Yeah, I don't collect Steven Universe stuff anymore. I I know if you were a big you were part of my early days of the channel, you know that I was big into Steven Universe, but I got out of that, it was just a phase. Don't know to do these Funko Pops. Still want to keep them, because, I don't know, I'm a hoarder. Um, whatever I just collect, I just keep. Even if it's damaged or something I'm not interested in anymore. Um, what are you doing, Hansel? Hansel! Oh, you're trying to get at your scratching post. Never mind. Um, I don't know. <laughs> um, sweet time. I might uh, have to uh 
retire this knife though. It's my uh, here let me just. It's my uh, I bought it on eBay, but this is my first buck knife I think I ever bought. Um, it's kind of rough down here because I wasn't sure how to sand prop or polish properly, so I just used a grinder or like a sanding tool. So I thought that would maybe polish it and then polish it with the, like the actual polishing piece, but that didn't work. So I learned from my mistakes. It needs to be polished again, but. Eh. I just bought this off eBay on eBay, so I'm not even sure what it says anymore. Let's see. Um three fifties. Oh. Uh, yeah, I'm on, this one I accidentally stabbed a what was it? I think it was my fence. I don't remember what I stabbed. But the tip broke off, so I just had to grind it to be pointy again. It's still not as pointy as my other one. My Sorry about that, I almost shaved my face. I didn't know I could do that. Yeah, here's my newer Buck 110. It's kind of shinier, but... And see, that's the point that's supposed to have. It's really fucking needle on point thing. Sorry I keep setting you guys down, but I just... I'm using my phone to record, because... I don't have a laptop or a computer accessed, or I don't have access to a computer or laptop, so I have my camera, but I just don't have that. I actually have my laptop, but it, uh, I don't know where the charger is for it. See, it's like a Dell. Here's my uh, untagged zombie ghost face. So, yeah. And shit. Um, I have this mask that I, uh, I don't know if you guys follow, uh, Crypt TV, I think that's what they're called. There was one, like, video they did, like, scary movie thing. They did where someone was wearing this mask and they had a lantern and it was in the woods. So that was pretty cool. You can actually buy this on Amazon last I checked. I need to buy more so I can make more, uh, Joker masks. I need to find the one I want to sell. I it's in my bed somewhere. <gasps> Is it going to there? I don't know. Um, trash. Yeah, I'm trying to wait for this to, uh, dry up so I can get back to, uh, I need to patch those holes, actually. There's one, like, right here. Yeah, there, fucker. There's a big one right here. Probably because it was too thin at first, and then I also heated it up, so that, like, made it kind of wet, so. Yeah, I'm not going to mess with it right now. Um, what else am I working on? Um, I don't think I have any other projects. I might try to, uh, here, let me get it real quick. Uh, I might try to restore, um, might try to. Damn it. Well, I can't speak. The fuck? Get the fuck out of there. There we go. But I might try to restore this mask. And I don't know if it's restorable, but... It's my, actually my friends. He gave it to me, and I just... I, the reason it's kind of cracked and stuff, because it was in my closet, and I just crammed a bunch of stuff in there. But I originally used it to make... And that part's gone, but I can always sculpt it as part of it. I plan on making a fiberglass one of these one day. Oh, but the nose is chipped. God damn it. Might just have to buy a new one. I might even just have to buy, like, a custom one and just, like, fucking, uh, mold it in silicone and, uh, cast fiberglass. I, w I do want to get into fiberglass making. I want to get into fiberglass mask making, like, Nightmare Show Studios. You, at least he kind of does it sometimes. Like, he, uh, makes his skull his chrome skull mask in a fiberglass i think he still has that mold but uh yeah um here's my uh ceramic one i still need to repaint the hell out of it because i realized that's not really as accurate i might do that pretty soon um let's see let's get another desk desk yeah yeah, that part broke off 
when I was trying to add the drip, it's fine. Kind of ugly on the inside. It's got the molded things right there, but I might paint those. Um, still need better paint. I might just paint it gray. And just get black wash on here, maybe. So I basically just dry brush this, actually. I think, I'm not sure. I don't remember. But it's pretty decent. I just need to put mesh in it, too. It's pretty decent, though. I like it. Yeah, I might work on this again sometime. I mean, it fits me because it's meant to fit me. So it's actually retooled off the uh, Fun World one, which I believe is molded off of the uh, TV show one. One in the TV show. I also have this. My uh, I know this is just not math vlog stuff anymore, but here's my uh, Buck One Night. Oh yeah, One Nineteen. So yeah, that's pretty cool. Need to polish it a little bit though. The only part on it that's mirror like is the uh, guard. Um, that's not really mirror like, but also the very bottom of the blade, like right here. The rest of it's not really mirror like, mirror finished. But I kind of wish it was, even though it's not really accurate to a ghost face knife. Well, not this one at least, because this is a buck 119. And Ghost Chase uses a buck 120. But what I mean by uh, not accurate is. In MTV Scream. The first. I think the first two seasons. I'm not sure. I don't know about the third season. But um. Brandon James uses a buck 119. And I don't think. It's mirror finished like Ghost Chase. Because this is mirror finished like Chrome. You can see yourself in it. I just almost showed my face. I think I did kind of. But whatever. But, uh, yeah, it's supposed to be mirror finish like that. But it's fine. It's still really sharp, though. Really nice. Don't really go hunting or anything. I just wanted this because Brandon James uses it. Also, in the collection, uh, the collector uses it. And most people can only find this knife for the collector. But I actually have the collector's actual knife right here. It's actually a throwing knife. I need to polish this as well. Clean it up. The only thing that's not accurate about this one is this cut right here, it's like a hole, and it says super on it. That's not accurate. Not sure if that's accurate or not the company thing, I'm not sure. Yeah, it's a pretty nice knife. It's a throwing knife. I've tried throwing this thing, I'm not going to get it, but it's still pretty cool. If you want an actual, like, uh, screen accurate one, but not sharp or metal or anything, there's a... Don't remember who sells it on Etsy, but there's an Etsy one that says like Arsenal Green Arrow knife or whatever. And I'm not sure. It's actually act. It's like I think molded off of this. It's got this part, this like cut out in this hole on the handle, and uh, it doesn't have this cut out right here, right there. So yeah, and it doesn't say super. And it doesn't have this brand name. So if you want like an actual screen accurate one, but not metal or real. Um, that's the way to go. I think it's, like, maybe 20 bucks, maybe, 30, I don't know. I don't remember. But yeah, it's a pretty nice knife. Jesus Christ, I need dust. <laughs> My knife left a dust imprint. God damn. <sighs> I just knocked that over. But, uh, yeah. Um. God damn it, Penny Want, or Leaders Club thing. There we go. Um, I think I'm just dragging this on too long. Um, what are you doing, Gretel? Gretel, get away from there. I don't want you breaking that. You're known to break shit. Yeah, this is Gretel. Ow. Um. So yeah, I think I'm gonna go, guys. Um, make sure to like, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell, do whatever you want. I don't care. What kind of care? It's just. I doubt I'm going to get a 1,000 subscribers. I only think I have 115, maybe. I don't know. Yeah, do what you want, I guess. Talk to you guys later. Bye.